Good afternoon everybody and welcome to our drive before the drive. You may think who is behind the cloth drawn head. Well, it's me and this is apparently my punishment for not finding a leopard this morning and for Taylor McCurdy finding a lion. So now I had to wear a cloth thing to see what it's like to have long golden hair. It doesn't really flop around like Taylor's hair or Ali's hair would do so. Well, I think it's a bit of a fail. I wanted to use grass, but then I had a flat tire, so there was no time to go and collect grass. So I've now got a sheet on my head instead, or what is this actually? It's a scarf, I would imagine, something like that. And anyway, I've been trying to put it on and I can't imagine how the girls must feel when they're driving around and this is fluttering about in the breeze. And I'll tell you one thing, it also makes it very hot. So I can sympathize with the girls in summer when they have longer hair because it does very warm underneath this piece of cloth. Now, I don't know how long I have to wear this for. Nobody told me time I think Alice just said you have to wear it and this is punishment for losing to the leopards and what I might do is have to try and tie it in a little bit more of kind of like a ponytail that then goes through the back of my cap over here that I'll be able to then wear it properly more like a girl's hair what do you think Craig you wear a cape what's the best way <laughs> not sure eh? you'll have to ask Google does Batman ask Google on his Thanks, Megs. So Megs says that she thinks that I look beautiful. Thanks, Megs. But it doesn't quite flow yet, Megs. I want it to be able to, like, flip and flop around in the breeze as I drive along and throw my hair around. So I'm going to have to try and see if I can't come up with another way to do it. Maybe I'll add some grass for some bit of sort of highlights and splash. So... 